It's R vs Python. In this video, we will compare how to create histograms of residuals for the analysis of variance test. We will be using fake cancer data with survival days as the response variable and gender and cancer type as factors. We will also include the interaction of gender and type. So sit back and relax while we compare how to create histograms of residuals in R and Python. Okay, so in order to do this, in Python, we're going to have to import a few things. So this is for Python only. So first, let's import pandas as pd. And we'll import statsmodels.formula.api as smf. And we'll import statsmodels.api as sm. And we'll go ahead and import pyplot as well. And let's run that. And let's go ahead and make this a matplotlib notebook. Now over here in R, we need to start by reading in the data. Read in the data. So we'll do data is read.table. And we'll start typing the file and tab over. And we'll do header equals true. And let's go ahead and see what that looks like. There it is. Our header came out on top right here. And the data looks good. So let's get rid of that. Back over here to Python, let's go ahead and read in the data. We use data equals pd.read underscore csv. And we'll go ahead and tab over that name as well. And in Python, let's separate this with a regular expression by space. And let's see what that looks like. See, Python automatically reads in the header right here. And that looks good as well, so let's get rid of it. Next, going back to R, let's go ahead and make a factor. So to make sure that gender is indeed categorical, we're going to turn it into a factor by saying factor of data gender. And in Python, we'll do something very similar. Let's make this a factor as well. We'll do data of gender is equal to data gender dot as type string. And that should do the same thing. Now we're going to create a linear model over here in R. So model.lm is what we'll call it. And we'll do lm for linear model equals data of days tilde data of type plus data of gender. And we'll also include the interaction of type and gender. Excellent. Now over here in Python, we'll do the same thing. Let's create our linear model. So we'll do model underscore LM is equal to SMF.OLS. And in a big string, we'll type the column name. So days tilde type plus gender plus the interaction of type and gender. And we'll specify data equals data and we'll do dot fit at the end. All right. Now back to R, let's go ahead and make the histogram of the residuals. So we'll do hist of residuals of model.lm. And there it is, it gives us a title and everything and it defaults to this black and white. Now going back to Python, we'll make a histogram of the residuals here. So we'll do plt.hist of model underscore lm dot resid for residuals. And I'm going to go ahead and put an edge color so you can see the distinct bins better. And plt.show. And there it is in Python. So there you have it. That is how you can do histograms of residuals for the analysis of variance test in both Python and R. Be sure to check out some of my other Python videos. And don't forget to hit subscribe.